Okay, Susanna asks, you said animals are learning words out of kindness to us and want to communicate. Are there animals who are mad at us or annoyed and don't want us to want to deal with our primitive level of wisdom about oneness and not killing for food? Could you say that again? I want to make sure I get it all. Yeah. So she, she says that you, you said that animals can learn words out of kindness for us, but are there any that are mad at us or annoyed? Um, and maybe they don't want to deal with our primitive level of wisdom about oneness and about not killing for food. So are they mad at us because we killed them, because we've harmed them, because we've killed them for food? I have experienced that, yes. Yes. Although once I speak to someone on the other side, they'll talk about that anger and the injustice and the horror, not from a place that that they might have when they were still here it's more subdued but it's still real and they haven't forgotten it and i'm not saying every animal who's killed feels that way but yes i have experienced that interesting uh, can our companions our companion animals sense our feelings at all times I think that depends. And first of all, I've never done a survey of every, every animal companion on earth to <laughs> say definitively. Um, but I, I think that most of them are very, very attuned to our feelings. Um, but the thing we have to remember too is animals are so unique and they're all individuals. And just like people are personality wise, um, I think there are some people who can live with other people and not be attuned to their feelings at all. Um, I think, and this is a stereotype on my part, so forgive me, but I think animals are tend to be better at that than the majority of humans. But I've also known some animals who are pretty, uh, if you know Myers-Briggs personality inventory, <laughs> they'd be thinkers, not feelers, and sensors, not intuits, not intuitive types. Um, so I think there's some animals who may not be tuned into what's going on with us all the time. Um, but I think they're very good at doing it in general. They so do have different helps. personalities. Yeah. i I'm a teacher of the Enneagram and I, I know the Enneagram type of all of my animals. Yeah. <laughs> there's a six, there's a four. There's a yeah. nine. Uh, so it, uh, some do care a lot and some don't yeah, seem they're, to. They're all much. a little different. Yeah. Yeah. yeah just like yeah. us. 